Okay, here we are talking about counter flashing and flashing. This is the counter flashing here. Uh, each piece is individual. And here's the step. Well, at the very top, how is that supposed to terminate? Well, what we have here is we have essentially a piece of step, and that gets beat in to make this little reveal here. It doesn't seem like it, but that's about not quite half an inch, but it still matters because there's a slate that goes on top of that. Yeah, that slate could be missing, but for the job, um, that's going to go in there. That's going to be held in there by, I don't know, probably like a slate hook or something. I'm put one in and maybe like a high nail or something, but this is all gets a, a saddle ridge. So the, the saddle ridge on top of this will hide all that. But what we're talking about here is this little gust piece that goes around here and caps this. This goes up here and you got about two inches right there and that's all you really need to make sure that this head right here is watertight and as this counter flashing gets put into the mortar here every piece counters the piece above it. Very important and at the top here there's gonna be one piece that'll counter left and right side. I don't know a hundred things is called head piece top whatever just a big piece of counter flashing it just is one center piece but that piece with a gusset in it this is what makes it watertight and don't worry about that nail there's another piece of flashing that's over top of there because of the type of hip that's being used here well there you go